Hey y'all, it's Joe, just Joe, and I am back today to do, uh, get ready with me. I've already done my facial products, so they'll be listed below. But if you like this type of video, you like unboxings, you like story times, just like, comment, subscribe, and click the bell, and let's get into it. So I'm finally getting to the Hummingbird palette. This is by um, Ozan Fancy Face. This is the front. Of course, the back has the ingredients. And let's show you the colors because this is gorgeous. And that's the colors. So I have no idea what I want to do. Um, there's really only, uh, there's five mats and let's see, how many? Seven shimmers. I think I want to go to this bright, uh, pinky mango color hibiscus. Kind of out of it today. Some of my medication's been swapped, so it's kind of messing with me. So I seem a little out of it. That's why I'm just going to use this Luxie 237 small blender. We'll take up just a little bit because these are usually pretty pigmented. And I'm kind of going to stamp where I want it. Oh, that's pretty. Y'all hear my stomach growling. I'm sorry about that. I am hungry, but I am getting ready to go for lunch. That is a very pretty color. But just going with some friends. I'm not going to do something too extravagant. Well, I'll say not too extravagant, but not extravagant for me. That is a very pretty color. I'm going to wipe the brush off a little bit. Kind of blend it out. Oh man. That is a really pretty. I don't know what kind of co color. I mean, pinky mango almost is what I would say. It is really pretty. I think I'll do that to the other side. I don't want to blend it out too much because I want the color to show, but I may have to go back and do a little blending. How's everybody doing today? We um, had a storm, even on the weather alert said that we weren't going to have a storm. But that's kind of the way it goes in Tennessee. The weather's always doing something crazy. So I'm a little sore on top of being in pain already. I really like this blue liner from Lethal. I think it's um, analog with this pinky color. I hope you all are doing good. It's the only thing about YouTube. I make so many friends in so many other states and some of them I worry about, but I can't get to them, so I'm just going to take that up under the eye. I'm just flattening the tip of my brush. I really love that blue against that color. But I do message everybody that I can message and let them know I'm thinking about them. It just kind of stinks that you can't run and visit somebody, you know. So, I think I want to deepen it up with this dark lagoon, like a navy blue. Um, use this Moda. Uh... Oh, it don't have a number. It says Essential Crease Brush.
Yeah, that's pretty. I don't know if this is the right brush. It might be a little too fluffy. Just bring it in my crease just a tad. Get some definition. Yeah, I don't think this is the right brush. Let's grab a different brush. I need to wash my brushes. That's the main problem here. Let's do the Soeva 223. Well, my cat is meowing at me. Oh, yeah, that's better. That's much better. Oh, that's so pretty. I feel like a colorful day today. Brush is making a big difference. I just chose the wrong brush. That was my fault. We gotta get them evened up. I don't care if they're a hundred percent even, but I do like them in the kind of in the realm of being even. It's really pretty. I think I'll really need to shimmer, but I don't know if I'm going to use one shimmer or two. But I do believe I am going to cut the crease with uh, my glue here. I'm just going to put a little Nick splitter glue on the back of my hand. Sometimes I'll put it directly on the brush. It just depends. And then I'm just going to cut a half crease. Mm, now what color to put? I think I'm going to use this Tropics kind of teal green in the middle for sure Oh, that's pretty. And then on the other side of that brush, I'm going to go into Feathers, this neon shimmer green. And do that in the front. And kind of blend them into each other. Oh, look how pretty that is. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I like that a lot. Okay, so let's do the same thing to the other eye. Get some glitter blue going. I am so into duo and multi-chromes right now. I just think they make your eyes pop. And I know a lot of people be like, that's not a fall look, but I'm, I'm just not that girl. I don't look at palettes as seasonal. I just do whatever color I want and go for it, you know? 
So I'm going to pick up that tealish silver. That is so pretty. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna the rest over here. I'm gonna utilize as much as I can. Gosh, this is making it hard for me to decide if I like Fancy Face, which is Tina, or Annette's palette more. I think you could get more kind of neutral looks out of Annette's, which is shocking since she's not a neutral girl. Oh, that's so pretty. But, if you really want color, really want color, I think this is the palette. I'm going to put this um, pink, fancy, kind of a duo chrome into purple. I'm just going to stab that right in the inner corner. Oh, it's so pretty. What do you guys think? I'm really thrilled with this look a lot. Again, I think I already said it. My face, my lips, all that stuff's in the link below. Let's put on mascara and finish this look up. This is gorgeous, guys. But let's get it finished up. I've got glue all over my hand. <laughs> I'm just going to use the It Blowout. Lash mascara. I have a bad habit of it went my stomach again of uh, putting my mirror up in between everything when I know what I need it for. Next step. Still can't make a nice pretty face when I do mascara, but That's okay. I don't think I'm going to do falsies today, guys. I don't know how many times I do falsies on camera, actually. I was looking back at some footage. I do have them to go out. I don't know why I don't do them on camera. It's kind of weird, but... I guess it is what it is. I will be listing Tina's channel, The Fancy Face, in the description box. If you'd like to see more looks with this palette, she's done a bunch. And all her videos are amazing. So, guys, I think this is it for me. I'm really happy. So, anyways. So, obviously, y'all know it's not a first impression. I've used Odin's Eye quite a bit. I love their formula. And it's another success. I love the Butterfly Palette. So if you guys like videos like this, like, comment, subscribe, ring the bell. I hope you're having a good day. I hope you're making good decisions and staying safe. And I love you guys, and I want to see you in the next video. Bye, guys.